Did you miss me? I spent the last couple of days in a hotel because I was too scared to sleep here. I'm low on money though, so I couldn't stay any longer. I feel a bit better. The apartment doesn't seem as scary now. I've been reading about hauntings and other people's experiences. The consensus is that the phenomena can't physically hurt you even if it is scary, so maybe I can learn to live with it. Oh yeah, uh, Dan's parents messaged me yesterday to see what's going on with him. He hasn't been talking to them either. I told him he's ignoring me too. I texted him a couple of times from the motel, but he hasn't responded. Adeline, the paranormal lady, finally emailed me back and said she could come meet me, but she's not free until next Thursday, so I guess I have to just fend for myself until then. I just got back from the grocery store and I ran into this lady outside the building who lives on my floor, Mrs. Pearson. I don't know her first name. Uh, she's lived here for a long time, so I asked her about previous tenants in my apartment. I asked her if there's ever been any kids living here. She said, uh, that there was a mother and her son who lived here for a couple months several years ago. I asked her if the boy died. She said no and gave me a weird look. Now that I think of it, I should have asked her for what their name was. I could have looked the mom up on Facebook and seen if there was a picture of the boy. What the fuck? Okay, you guys gotta see this. I'm gonna switch to my phone. It happened. Again. <laughs> Shit! That drawer just opened on its own. Let's see if it happens again. I don't know why this thing likes dishes so much. I just wish it would stop breaking things I have to pay to replace. Uh, okay, it's not I can't sleep. Uh, I'm so fucking scared. At least I don't feel that physical presence here anymore like I did before. Knock on wood. <sighs> I know it sounds lame, but talking to the camera gives me comfort. Sorry, I, I wish I could make these videos more entertaining for you guys, but unfortunately, that's up to the ghost. Or ghosts. I wonder if someone from the clothing store saw these videos and thought I was crazy. Maybe that's what they're talking about? I don't know. I tried calling. I don't know what just happened there. My laptop just shut off for no reason. It better not be the ghost. I'll be pissed if it's fucking around with my electronic devices now.